Yo, what up guys? Back out here. Um, in today's vlog, I'm gonna be going over uh, my Grom and uh, giving you my uh, top five things that I uh, love about my uh, 2017 Grom. Let's go, there's a lot, there's a lot, it's fun. All right, so the first thing I love about the bike is the form factor. It is, the size of it I think is just perfect for highway driving. And then on top of that, just the styling of it is really dope. It's, uh, it looks like, basically it looks like a mini sports bike, but it's not like a mini pocket bike, you know? It's still like its own little class. It's a 125cc. Um, I love these little, you know, just like these body pa panels. The front, this is a 2017. So it does have the, uh, the updated front lights and stuff. It looks like Iron Man to me, I love it. I love the gold. All the colors have just little gold accents right there, which I think look dope. Um, and yeah, just in general, the Grom. I just love the Grom, I guess, just the form factor, just what it is. Um, you, could, you could be sitting on this or, you know, in the highway and it, it, it weighs nothing compared to other bikes, you know, like I'm, I'm standing, it's in between my legs right here, look at that, just nothing, nothing, dude. And on top of that, it has power, you know, you could go 60 miles per hour in the, in the city, easy, you know, just passing through cars, everyone will be looking at you like, yo, how, how is this thing going that quick? They're always surprised, man. Everyone is just looking at you. Um, so yeah, man, just the form factor is, is, uh, what I think is what the number one cool thing about it is. Um, I also like that they, they added, or they still have the option to have, you know, a buddy or someone to ride on the back with you. This is the little pegs for them to put their feet on. Um, I mean, I wouldn't suggest any long rides, but just to show off your bike and just to get around, you know somewhere it's pretty useful it's pretty cool they added that and it's legal um yeah form size size is dope the weight is dope you know it's not gonna kill you kill your legs i've gotten you know an hour an hour long rides on this I, and i'm six foot tall and i you know no problems at all for me so it is a it's really something else. It's a really cool, cool size. All right, the next thing I love about my bike is the upgrade I've done. I've uh, updated the exhaust into this uh, aftermarket exhaust. Um, I, I love the sound of it. it sounds really dope. It's uh, super loud, which is uh, needed for a Grom. The stock exhaust is really quiet. And that in turn is uh, really dangerous because other cars basically won't see you if you just creep up on them, you know, they'll just run you over. So this thing, you could just push the crap out of it, dump the clutch, push it, get nice and loud, you know, scare whoever's around you. And then you could also keep it nice and low if you want, you know, in residential areas. Um, not only that, I just love how the color is changing now too with the heat. Just within the months that I've been driving, it's turning blue. It's gonna just start changing color now. And uh, let me show you guys how this sounds actually too. I mean, I, it doesn't cost no more than, you know, 200 bucks. So it's another cool thing.
on one, they'll be. They do not expect how loud this thing is gonna be, or how fast it goes, man. So yeah, that leads me into my next thing that I love is the uh, gauge cluster. It reminds me of a uh, S2K. Super cool, super uh, informative, super simple. You know, it has the rim right there. Got the miles per hour. Got the fuel. You know, just super simple. I like it. Yeah, like I was saying, it's basically like a STK, which I really like. And uh, yeah, no complaints, man. It's useful, easy to see while you're riding, you know, tinted, you know. Yeah, man, 100 miles per gallon, you know, just going out to the store, getting something small, going out to the park. I just take this guy now. Um, still got my little, still got my blob eye right there, but Dude, the Grom is fun, dude. The Grom is fun. So, yeah, that's the other cool thing that I love about it, especially about the, especially with the prices going up now, over four bucks for a freaking gallon, you know? The Grom comes in handy for just stupid shit around the, the city and whatnot. All right, guys, let's uh, jump into a uh, real quick cinematic of the Grom and uh, just showing just some of the upgrades that I've done and then we'll uh, jump back in and uh, I'll talk about some of the upgrades and show you guys up close what I've done. the Grom is how easy it is and how much stuff aftermarket is available for the car or for the for the motorcycle um, I'm sure like you could see in mine I do have a few upgrades onto it I have a cold air intake which sounds really cool once you're riding onto what you're riding it and changing gears and whatnot it sounds really nice um, I've added these upgraded grips this uh, adjustable levers both sides um and it's just fun to work with you know just fun getting out your tools and you know working on the car or on the, the motorcycle um i have the uh back license plate delete which the stock one has i put on this one which looks a lot better um just dressed up the tires painted the little brembos brembo looking brakes just a little add a little flair to it you know can't go wrong with a little accents here and there. Yeah, man, I also, like I've said, changed out the stock mirrors into these aftermarket ones that I've gotten from Amazon for like 20 bucks. Super worth it. Um, yeah, man. I've also changed out these lights as well. All right, y'all, so that's it for today. Um, that's all I could think of. Uh, I will be having more vlogs with this, uh, with the Grom. I'll be having trips and stuff. I'll be doing some ride-alongs. Just uh, stay tuned, subscribe, like the video, leave a comment down below if you liked it. If not, leave a comment below. Let me know what's up. Have a good one, dudes. Peace.